Welcome back once again to the Fuel Show. Now, we've alluded to it all day. This is a special in the pit segment, and we have a chance to check out the brand new Torkoal Imp. Now, this vehicle isn't due in the showrooms for a few years, but we've got it, we've tested it, and now we're bringing it to you. The first category is Q Factor. It's the Gadget or Tech Score. And you talk about Bluetooth enabled. This thing has got Bluetooth everywhere. It's got wireless charger for all your devices. So basically, it's a pad in the center console. You set your wireless phone on it, and it charges it without having to plug it in. Sure, and I like the optional 108-inch plasma television that doubles as a low platform on top of the vehicle. Where else can you get high-definition screen and your barrels of oil on top of one vehicle? For us, it's got to be out of sight on score. We'll give it a 5 for Q-Factor for the Thoico Imp. Curb Appeal is the next category for the Thoical Imp, and do I need to remind you that it's a tank? That's right, it's a tank, and what do you do with a tank? Anyone else in the world that would possibly even insult, make fun of, or even so much as dare say anything bad about your Thoical Imp, you know what you do? Drive over them. That's right. Why are we going to score it? We'll give it a five again. Now on to performance, the next category for the Thoical Imp, and well, if you're in snow, it's just about perfect. Yes, snow, air, water, it doesn't matter. You're talking about a twin turbocharged dual overhead cam, 16-cylinder Wankel dual rotor with chrome muffler barrelings, two-speed timing chain, 426 horsepower, 1,621 pounds-feet of torque. It goes 0 to 60 in 2 seconds and has a top speed estimated of over 300 miles an hour. Only if you have both hands on the controls. Yeah, and it is both hand control. It's actuated steering just like a tank, and it's also got limited slip rear differential. It's got traction control, obviously, because it's got paddles on the treads. That's right, Ian. How are we going to score the we'll, Thoracle Amp? We'll give it another five, another perfect score for the Thoracle Amp. Fit and finish is the next category for the Thoic Olympic. And you talk about build quality, it's solid. There's not a flaw. All the panels meet and all, everything fits together beautifully. I really like the material choices inside. The optional orange ostrich leather interior with the mink headliner. That was a nice feature. Yeah, and you look at the rhinoceros skin covered steering wheel and also the optional ram horn gear shift lever. I mean, it really does bring kind of a, a real motif of Africa to the wheel. Now, when you're looking at the outside, the way that they've really been able to take the skin of tiny rats and spread it out over it for kind of a kind of an industrial feel. That in tune with the carbon fiber exterior pieces, that 108 inch plasma, I mean the fit and finish is better than anything. You take Bentley, Mercedes Benz, anything on the planet and it just pales in comparison to the Thorkel M. Yeah, now you look at the sheet metal on the outside, it looks like pop rivets. They're not, they're actual diamonds that they painted over and that gives it an extra rigidity on the exterior. Yeah, the diamond is the strongest, strongest piece in the world, but how are we going to score it, Ian? We'll give it another perfect score for the Thoical Imp, a five. Drivability is the final category for the Thoical Imp, and you talk about the ability to crush opponents with its tank treads, and the panache and the je ne sais quoi of the ostrich interior is just top notch. Yeah, you take that 108 inch plasma, not only entertainment, but also a great load floor for everything you'd want to take along. Now, something we didn't mention some of the other categories, the fact that it's watertight, much like a submarine. It can actually drive under the water in case you were, say, at Maui and wanted to go to Molokai Point. Now, you throw in the optional torpedoes and it actually could be a warship because it does have the optional flotation around the vehicle that then has the optional floating device for, say, a wind sail. So there's so much capabilities of the vehicle. There's also the available tank trailer that goes along with it in case you want to have 17 of your friends come along. There's just nothing that this vehicle cannot do. And again, I think it's why we're going to score it perfectly. We will. We'll give it a five for drivability for the Thoica Limp. Now we do enjoy doing the new modern vehicles of today, but we have to remind you one thing. One, thank you for coming and joining us on the Fuel Show. And again, make sure and check your calendar today because there's one thing we have to leave you with. Happy April Fools! The Fuel Show is made possible by the Russ Auto Group, Baxter Auto Parts, Northside Ford, Four Wheel Parts Performance Center, Grand Prix Imports, and Ray Reese Dealerships.